do you bother me? Getting in the way of any chance of harmony that I could have ever hoped to have within my life. Now all I have are my troubles and my strife stemming from you, yes you, with the hair, with the teeth, with those eyes, with the same chubby clothes you still wear, at least that's what I imagine when I see you. Through my mind's eye every day, nine years may have passed, but how you look and what you'd say remain as clear as a bell, ringing continuously in my ear, your silhouette in my dreams makes me convinced you're still here. Who'd have thought four months of an expected 80 years could have such an impact? Could, like that, could leave <laughs> such lasting fear? In that moment, when innocence was lost. I knew it'd never be the same. I felt a layer of frost freeze over my heart as a weakness struck my knees. Game face, girl, game face, you've got people to please. You're etched in my memory. I guess that's the way it will always be, but I'll store you in the bitter part, the part with no access to my heart. I've come a long way since that fateful day when you grabbed my arms, my legs, closed the door, drove away, say goodbye to your house, you'll never see it again. Don't make me laugh, darling. You underestimated my zen. An exterior of calm I obtained as you drove like a psycho. Ironic, a word you once used to insult my big bro. And oh, by the way, my dad, he's not an alcoholic. My God, you spew some shit disconnected and robotic. He's a man. A real man. He's how you treat a girl. You would learn a thing or 50 if you weren't so shut off from the real world. You took away any feeling. And the rest, my conscience, my pride, my trust, me at my best. But I can get that back, my dear. You can't ever change your eyes, embedded with evil, riddled with lies. Poor you. You're stuck with you. I don't have to be, not anymore. I'm ready to be free. I forgive you. Not for you, for me, but I do. I do, because you see, I'm glad it was... I'm glad it was me. Me you deceived, and not another lady. Without what you did, I wouldn't be this smart. So thanks, you bastard, for helping me create this piece of art. <laughs>